learned a lot about coffee beans. Uh, but do you have any tips when I'm gonna buy the the beans from the store? Yeah. What should I look for? Yeah, I mean, a lot of different coffee companies present coffee in a lot of different ways. But I mean, most of them talk about the roast degree. Mm. So they talk about light roasted or medium roasted or dark roasted. Yeah. That's always a good thing to think about with the settings and think the darker the roast, the lower temperature you can brew with. The lighter the roast, the higher temperature you want, and maybe a little bit finer ground. Mm. Um, then they talk about fruity or chocolatey or these sorts of mm. things. Mm -mm. And again, the more fruity, more acidic sounding names, the kind of less coffee you want to have in the porter filter. Mm, okay. Um, and that's going to help you to make sure that you extract and don't get too much of an acidic cup. Mm -hmm. um, then they often talk about how much Robusta they might have in their blends. Uh, most of the uh, coffee makes on the uh, Scandinavian market are 100% Arabica, yeah. with some exceptions with Robusta. That's when I see. That's, yeah. that's what I see when yeah. I go into yeah. the store. Um, but those Robustas think that they're going to be a little bit more uh, intensive, a little bit more bitter, mm -hmm. uh, and there you want to be careful not to be too bitter mm -hmm. uh, when you're brewing your coffee. Yeah. Yeah. But I really hope that this series of videos have kind of given you some tips about you know, what kind of settings can you give your machine to get out different flavors, a little bit of that curiosity about where does coffee really come from and how does it get into my cup. Um, and good luck, and I hope you get some delicious cups of coffee going forward. Good luck.